It's hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. Hi, it's me, Ventbot. I'm back again to show you another tutorial on Rec Room. Uh, for this one, we're going to create a trigger volume that outputs a number of people inside of it so that we can display text for the user. So in this example, I want to know how many people are inside this box here, and I want to display a message in text up here. So to get started, I'm going to look at my watch, click on Backpack, and click Use under my Maker Pen. Then I grab my Maker Pen, and I'm going to look at it, and click Create. Then click Open Palette, and I want to go to Gadgets, Other Gadgets, and these are listed in alphabetic order. I want Trigger Volume. So that is on the third page for me. I'll click Trigger Volume, close out of my palette, and then I'm going to just build my Trigger Volume. I'm actually going to look at my pen and rotate it so that my arrows are a little bit easier to see. There we go. Now if I look at my pen again, I can click Manipulate and make the trigger volume as big as the box. It doesn't have to be exact as long as it covers it. to be a little bit taller for those people that maybe stand a bit taller. So I'm going to make it that. So now you can see it covers my entire box. Now I need to put the text up on the wall. So I'm going to look at my Maker Pen, click Create, open my palette, and I'm already on the Gadgets tab under Other Gadgets, and you'll see I'm on the third page. I'll click Text. So then I close out of my palette. I'm going to place the text right here. And the next part's really easy. I'm going to look at my Maker Pen, click Wire, and there's three arrows coming out of the trigger zone, trigger volume. When entering zone, total currently in zone, and when exiting zone. The one I want is total currently in zone. So I'm going to wire this to the red arrow on the text. You can see that it says text variable R. So that tells me that I need to, when I configure the text, type in R. So I'm going to look at my maker pen, click configure, and then click on the text. Here in the message, I can say something. Um, I'll say, people waiting. Now, if I want the number that was on the variable R, I can do a curly brace, R, curly brace. I said number R, it's letter R. And then I'll close out of that. So you can see zero people are waiting. And if I go into the box, now it says one. If more people were in here, it would say two or three. When I go out, it says zero. So let's look at, let's pull out my maker pen again. I want to make this a little bit bigger. So I'm going to click scale, click on the text and make it bigger so that I can see it from further away. Now, maybe I don't want any text showing if nobody's in the box at all. So in order to do that, I'm going to need a math chip. So if I look at my Maker Pen, go to Create, Open Palette, and under the Gadgets tab, I want to go to Math Chips. I want to use a Compare chip because I want to compare a couple values. So I'm going to move over here. I'm going to spawn the Compare chip and then go to Configure and Configure the chip. 
Now you'll see the mode by default is equal. I want it to be not equal. So it's this little equal sign with a slash through it. Now the way I can hide it, if I click on wire on my maker pen, you'll see that the black arrow hides the text. Now what's different about this is it needs a one value to hide the text. So I'm going to wire the total currently in zone to the red pin. And if I go over top of the output chips, the red one, it says out zero. The green one says else out one. So that's the one that I want to wire to the hidden. So I'll wire that. And if I drop my maker pen, you can see the text is not there. If I move into the box, all of a sudden it appears. Not there. There. Not there. There. Okay. So there you have it. Uh, if you liked the video, please leave a like. If you didn't like the video, please comment below uh, what you didn't like about it, and we will try to make some improvements. Okay, thanks everybody. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.